Yo, what's up, guys? It's Healer Nero, and I'm back with another video. Today, I'm here to to just basically show you, and other YouTubers has done it, of of what 2K21 should look like. So, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Subscribe to the channel, and let's get right into the video. Welcome to the all new NBA 2K experience. Our goal as designers is to make a whole concept on what the community wants 2K21 to potentially look like. If you would like to use any of these in a video, please contact one of us on Twitter. Have a blessed day. By loading the and if you see on the bottom, there's all the Twitters, you know. So make sure you look those up too. And check those out. Let's get right to it. Introducing the new game cover for NBA 2K21 by loading. I actually, I love these covers. There you see there's Luka Doncic on the Standard Edition. Kobe Bryant on the Legends Edition. Then the Legend Gold Edition, Kobe Bryant. I feel like I actually thought Kobe Bryant would be on the... He would be like on every cover because... Kobe Bryant is legendary. Let's get right next to it. There you see standard edition Luka Doncic, number 77 from the Dallas Mavericks. Luka Doncic is our newest member to the 2K21 cover athlete team. So that's pretty awesome right there. And the legend edition, the 24 Kobe Bryant. In honor of his legacy, we had the opportunity to show off his legacy as the Black Mamba in the Legend Edition of NBA 2K21. This is perfect to represent NBA 2K21 with Kobe Bryant. I mean, we all knew Kobe was going to be on the cover, so there was nothing to be worried about right there. So here is the Legend Gold Edition of Kobe, number 8 and 24. In honor of his legacy, we had the opportunity to show off his legacy as the Black Mamba in the Legend Gold Edition of NBA 2K21. This is perfect to show and represent Kobe Bryant, the Black Mamba. Let's get to the next one. So this is basically what you will get when you just like basically. This is what you will get when you get like the when you get the pre order of NBA Two K Twenty One. You'll if you get the Luka Doncic Standard Edition pre order bonuses, you get five thousand VC. 5,000 MT early tip-off is on September the 5th, 2020. The Legends Edition pre-order bonuses is 35,000 VC. 10,000 MT early tip-off is on September the 1st, 2020. And also, the Legend Gold Edition is also on September the 1st, 2020. You get free 100,000 VC and 50,000 MT. So... Look forward to that when the game comes out. So, main screen. Let's get right. All right. This is the main screen of NBA 2K21. With our new engine, we are able to make our drastic changes to our menu design. Our goal is to provide a more user-friendly interface for NBA 2K21. So what I also notice about this cover is that that play now button right there, it looks like the 2K20 button. I just hope this game is nothing like 2K20 because 2K20 is just awful, 1,000% awful. So, yeah, I hope that works out for 2K. But I'm actually liking it because instead of you just going to my career and just doing all of that, you, you could just go to my part, which is right on that bottom right there. If you see right there, it's my part. You could just tap that my part button right there. Then I'll take you right to the my part. So that's pretty awesome instead of just going right through my career. My career. I was just talking about that. That's wonderful. Here it is. My career. Yes, sir. Here it is. You see, lock. Down defender, playmaking, and out an outside shooter. Six foot four, this is not everything. 
Now, this right here, this picture, is giving me some serious 2K14 vibes. Is this giving me 2K14 vibes? Like, the way it looks outside, the way the court is, the the got next buttons on the player, on the comparisons. It just makes me think of it, man. Welcome to the Improve My Player Building Experience. Choose up to three play styles and unlock badges to archetype as well as one diamond level badge to each category you choose. So this is better just because instead of having two instead of having like two builds you can have three. So this is this is lit. I'm starting to like it. So 2K please make this right the shit. Okay. My park experience. Now, I am on my park, and I am on my team player, so that should be pretty good. Affiliation section. Well, a few months back, Ronnie did say that affiliations are officially back. So, we officially got affiliations. Put your loyalty to the test with, with the my park game mode. We introduced... Three affiliations to choose from. Be careful with your selection. There is no turning back. So I think what that means is that whatever affiliation you choose, that's the affiliation you will be staying with and there's no way going back. So depending on how it like was giving me better vibes, we have not seen this since 2K17. And apparently the Rough Riders was looking pretty bad. So... I don't know. I don't know which one should I choose from, but let's just keep going and see. All right. The event calendar. We heard you guys and we excused. The My Park competition is at an all time high with rival events in the park. Be able to compete and win prizes to show off your skill. Do you have what it takes? Yes, I do have what it takes. Event calendar. There you see the return of Rival Day. Basketball Gods. Boot Camp. The Jordan Rex Center. There's no events there. You got Rush 1v1. There's no event right there. Formula 2K. I wonder what that is. And Treasure Hunters is back as well. And 2K20 it was terrible. Let's just get that straight. Then you see my rep. So it looks like Roti99 is not going to be there this year once again. It looks like my rep will be back. So I'm looking forward to that in 2K21. Let's move on. Rep level rewards. So it looks like they brought everything back from, from, from the past 2K, from 2K20 to 2K15. It looks like they brought back... You see there's a tiger, a beatbox, a boombox, mascot. You see um jetpacks and everything. This is just awesome, man. Our all new rep system has finally been revealed. Work your way up from rookie to legend in the my park game mode. If you have if you have what it takes to rep up in the park, you can enjoy some awesome rewards. This is solid. This is what we wanted to see in 2K20. Why didn't we have this in 2K20? Rumble ride to us. Let's just get, man. This is a, this looks awesome. Shout out to the people who made this. This is awesome. All new crew selection. So there's you see those those are the crew selections right there. The jerseys are looking pretty solid right there. We have seen the, the dedication and hard work you guys put into the 2K community when it comes to teams and crews. We have added a team crew selection where you can show off your loyalty. So it looks like, depending on which which crew you choose, you get a type of jersey and everything. This is solid. And I did use crew a lot in 2K20. So let's just hope that it's better in 2K19. I mean, 21, sorry. My part gameplay. This my part is looking solid. If you notice, for the past few 2Ks, those two, you see those two signs right there? 
which says got next and then there's like this two signs it looks like black top but this is the my part gameplay you see the got next right there you see my right there then you see somebody's ankles getting broken Another got next, and he's holding a basketball. So maybe you can hold basketballs, or like you could do something with it while you're doing, while you're standing on the got next. Man, it looked like he got crossed too. His ankles is right there. Enjoy the calm and relaxed ocean breeze at the Malib Malibu Ballers Courts, where your loyalty runs deep and the ice in your veins are hot. So this is awesome. I love this background. I'm really get I'm getting some good vibes about this. Let's just keep going. My part gameplay. Oh no. It looks good, but it looks bad, and let me explain why. Let me read this first. Sirens are loud and the competition is rising at the all new Atlanta Boomers Park. Make sure you have what it takes before you perform on these courts. So what the reason why I like it, and then I, I like it because it looks designable and everything. The bad, the thing I don't like is that it looks like 2K18. The, the buy boost was not there. This, in 2K18, that, where it says pre-order now with Kobe Bryant, King of the Court was right there. Got Next was never there. I just hope this is not like 2K18. But I like it. I love it. I love the the pictures are clean. Everything looks just clean. I love it. Shout out to Loading for making this. Gatorade event. They got a new Gatorade event. Uh, introducing your brand new addition to the competitive side of the spectrum. NBA 2K Gatorade event. Show off your skills and be the top of the world to earn yourself some great prizes. So your rewards, 50,000 VC, unlimited Gatorade boost, Gatorade right arm sleeve. You got Gatorade jacket. This is just awesome. I would love a Gatorade event. I would love it. I always go to the, I always go to the training facility all the time, every 2K. Always do it. I love it. All new clothes. So you get new clothes. Strip or drown. Personalize your My Player with the latest clothes at the My Park Fashion Shop. So it looks like they're going to change the name of the shop from Swags to the Fashion Shop. I don't know why. And, it, and if you notice, it costs less. It costs less than how it regularly would cost. And finally, 2K brought plain t-shirts. So now you can get just plain t-shirts. I'm going to get a lot of VC and I'm going to buy a lot of plain t-shirts so I can wear around the neighborhood. So that's it for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And just subscribe to the channel and peace.